guys, so welcome to Vlogmas Day 4. Even though it's like middle of December. So I'm waiting for my boyfriend to come out of the apartment. Because he takes longer in the morning to get ready than me. Um, which is actually kind of good because I just realized that my camera is like flashing on empty for battery. So it's good that he was still in the apartment so that he can go and get the, uh, the camera charger. So we are off to Emirates Equestrian Centre this morning. Boo and Silver are doing a hunter trial. And then we'll probably just stay there till the afternoon because then I have a show this afternoon with Gabbana and Niger. And I'm jumping the 120 and we will see how it goes. So yeah. And it's our last national show before the international season starts. So Urano is resting and yeah. So I just have the other two horses for the show jumping. So yes, I will try and vlog. I don't like vlogging at shows when people can see me, but I'll do my best. <laughs> A little bit of excitement there as they jump the third and disappear in Thomas Bush. Bob. Seems to go well, galloping at speed. Good turn there now. Pimsy Wimsy. Are you going to have your first victim? Silver quick to see his little speed wobble on the way down, but no problems at all. See you on the mound there. Ah, uh, big jump over that. They turn. Jump over that really well. Back onto the track. The corner by the Coliseum. Brilliant jump over that corner. They head back round the carpet rolls. Silver's fighting for control. Jumps out. One, two and a half. <laughs> That's okay. No, I haven't touched the turn for the Lego. So what are you going to think? There we go, no problem at all. Turns inside. I turn back to the EEC fans. Great jump there over the log. Now the double of corners at the Coliseum. Fantastic jump there of the first corner, another big leap at the second. They turn round, past the site of the new water complex. Raghu's promised me he's going to be finished by next time. Takes a stride out there. Great job. Lovely job. Jump that skinny really well. Great jump over Hammer Tump as well. Turns back to the Lego bricks. Great jump over that. He's desperately trying to make up time as he comes to the water.
just finished the Hunter trial. Uh, silver was second in the 60. Uh, the optimum time was 3 minutes and 32 seconds and we did it in 3 minutes and 13 seconds so we were like too fast. Um, but he jumped clear and he was awesome, didn't look at any of the jumps and Bern Bernie and Boo were fourth. It would have been first, only he rode, he f lost number 15, forgot where it was, so it didn't count as a refusal. It just uh, slowed his time down. But yeah, so we're going over to the stables now, check the horses, ice their legs. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. <laughs> Next in we have Lauren Elizabeth Alford driving Gabbana for the Alhamra Equestrian. Good girl, Larry. Go on. Last job. Fucking prick. That's the job. Go on that. Go on that. Oh, yeah. So I just finished the 120 class with Gabbana and Niger. I wrote Gabbana first and she was amazing. Um, it was probably one of my best rounds so far with her. Uh, I've only been riding her for like three months, under three months. And it was my third 120 show with her. Um, she was amazing. She was clear and fifth. Her canter still, she's still disunited like behind sometimes. And it's not just on one side, it's both sides. Um, so I need have a lot of work to do on the flat, but feeling a lot more together and like I really feel like we're starting to click and she's just so careful and she's so honest and I really love riding her. Um, and Niger, <laughs> I had the last fence down, I was so annoyed. Um, but I was happy with how I rode him. I was a little bit deep to number seven and then I had really really like chasing for the five strides. I was like you must go, there's no room for six. Um, but yeah and then I just had the last jump down. He literally took off and his front feet cleared and I was like oh we're clear and then he back to all and I was like Shouldn't have thought that you were clear, Lauren. It's your own fault. Um, I could have, like, the seven was short, especially because it was coming towards the end of the course. So I probably should have either ridden a little bit more outside. I rode a little bit, like, middle to middle of the jumps, but not to worry. Um, I need to check the results. There wasn't many clears today, so Nigel probably, he was quick, so he might have been placed four faults. But um, Gabbana was in the prize given. Um, and yeah got a fifth place with her which I wasn't even expecting to place because I actually almost rode past I jumped number like I jumped one and two and I nearly forgot where number three was and I kind of like jumped it on an angle <laughs> but I didn't take a circle I was like I'm not taking a circle no way 
Um, but yeah, she was fabulous the rest of the course. And I actually like dropped my stick like after number nine and it was like stuck on my boot between the stirrup. So I was like jumping, like, I don't know if you can, I, don't, I haven't watched the video yet. But yeah, it was like flapping on my leg and I was like, oh, please don't let this distract her. Like it's distracting me. But yeah, so this was Vlogmas. I missed yesterday because I had so many horses to treat like all over the place. I was in the car for like three and a half hours. So yes, enjoy this Vlogmas.